A million dollar dip that totally lives up to its name. Now you're gonna wanna pay close attention because this is gonna move fast. One million dollar dip coming right up. The creamy base starts with eight ounces of cream cheese and three quarters of a cup of mayonnaise. I let the cream cheese soften so it'll be easier to stir it together. So the first thing I wanna do is just smush all this together. Okay, that's the creamy base. Now I'll add the cheeses. One sharp cheddar, one cup. Two grated Swiss, one cup. And three blue cheese crumbles, a fourth a cup. Oh my gosh, it looks so good already. This is probably why it's called Million Dollar Dip. I'm gonna add eight pieces of bacon that have been fried crisp and cut really fine into a dice. And then some toasted almonds. And to toast them, I just bought slivered almonds and put them in a dry skillet over medium low heat and just kind of shook the skillet for about five minutes until they were golden and nutty. I could stop right here and eat this for dinner. <laughs> it is that good. Okay, the nuts and the bacon are mixed in. So I have a big pile of sliced green onions, three green onions to be exact. And for seasoning, I'm gonna keep it pretty simple. About a half a teaspoon of kosher salt and a quarter teaspoon of black pepper, a quarter teaspoon of garlic powder, and just a little bit of cayenne, about an eighth of a teaspoon. I'm using garlic powder instead of minced or grated garlic because sometimes when you add raw garlic to a dip and let it sit, it can sort of get overpowering. So the garlic powder keeps it from getting too strong. I mean, <laughs> stick a fork in me, I'm done. That looks so good. So I'm gonna go ahead and transfer it to the bowl that I'll serve it in. And it really just comes out in one neat little pile. <laughs> What a dip. I'm gonna cover it with plastic wrap because I wanna put it into the fridge for about four hours. And then when I serve it, I'll sprinkle on some extra green onions and I'll serve it with crackers. See what I mean by fast? All right, into the fridge. So here it is with chips and crackers, an amazing cookout dip, million dollar dip to be exact. I am definitely a fan. So this is how I do quick and easy cookouts on the ranch. Now I just need some people to come up here and help me eat all of this.